This is Al Morris, the host of Hype TV, and we are here downstairs at The Rat in Kenmore Square on Calm Ave in Boston, Massachusetts, where else? And I'm here with lead singer and guitarist from the legendary Boston band, Gangrene, Mr. Chris Doherty. Chris, welcome to Hype TV. Thank you. Nice, nice to be had, but I didn't know we were legendary. Oh, you kidding me? Your, rec your records on Tang are legendary all over the world, and you guys know it. But they, <laughs> yeah, maybe they are, but we never got paid for them. Well, that's an issue you might want to take up with, uh, well, you know. <laughs> now, what was the motivation be uh, behind getting back together? I know we saw you in your uh, Mercury Polygram project, Clover, here uh, not too long ago, actually. And uh, Walter is uh, also in uh, Mung, which is on Big Rig Records, uh, with, uh, another Mercury Polygram thing. It was just guys thought the time was right, want to go out and have some fun. Um, the pretty much was like the Clover thing was Mercury and... and uh, it just it wasn't really happening. Mercury wasn't behind us. It kind of sucked. I didn't like not being the singer. When we went out on the road, and I was just like standing there going, "Man, this is fucking lame." Look, like, I, I didn't like playing the music. I didn't like just being a fucking guitar player because I can't play guitar good enough to just be a guitar player. I was like, "Fuck!" I want to have some fun, and I got it back together. And you know, we've we've done like we played every night since Tuesday, and we're playing tomorrow. But you know, I don't know what's going to happen after this. But it was just. I wanted to get, get out there and have some excitement. And well, obviously, how has the crowd response been on the uh, previous shows this week compared to uh, tonight? I saw the day show today, the matinee all ages. Some of the kiddies might have been here. That was a good performance as well, but it didn't come close to the kind of mayhem that was breaking loose here tonight at the Rat. Jake from Tree joining us. Well, you know, everyone heard that Tree was going to be playing tonight, and that's why everyone came. Yeah. And uh, a couple kids came to us like, uh, gang, yeah, yeah, gang green. Gang I've green. heard of them. These guys were getting a little old, so we decided to take it a little easy on them. That's not what I heard. What I heard was that those guys were going out to buy more beer at 8 in the morning, and all the guys from Tree were coughing Z's somewhere in the back of their van, and no one was... Actually, I heard you were still drinking, Jake. That's right. Jake was still drinking. Everyone else was asleep. He was passed out on the floor. Gangrene got back together just for this tour. Are we going to see any recorded material or some compilation stuff put together, greatest hits kind of stuff, or CDs? Oh no, that's it. That's it. Right now, tomorrow's on my mind. We're gonna play CVs and then Monday, I'm gonna check into a rehab somewhere. Or at least <laughs> spend some quality time in front of my television, and then uh, you know we're gonna we'll see what happens after that. I mean, people are saying you know they want us to put us in the studio and keep going and all this, but you know I I, I want to move on. I mean, there's really it's fun. We're having a good time. There's really no future in yesterday, as far as I'm concerned. But I'm trying to start a new band and writing songs and getting ready to go in the studio with that. But, so, you know, if gangrene happens, it happens. If, I think if we do do something, hey, hey, you know what? Yeah, you know what we should do? If we do do, real quick. Booze. If we do, Booze. Do, do. If we do, do something, I think we'll, what we'll do, just to, out of respect for these guys, because they really need it, is go to Europe and take them with us. Tree and gangrene in Europe sounds like a killer show. Chris? Like a four ambulance night, anyways, and we're touring in ambulances. Yeah, yeah. It's all ambulance tour. We're sponsored by. Uh, 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 I don't know. Beer drinkers of America, and the beer truck will be in tow because you guys drink a lot of beer when you play up there. You actually wear a lot too. It was pretty slippery up there. We had uh, some problems with uh, some of the electronics and stuff. I saw some people throw home bottles at you guys. Is that par for the course, or? Yeah, you know, you never know what's going to happen when you come to a gangrene show. It, it, it was just the way this shit always was, and. Uh, I think it sucked that it was too, probably it was my fault, I spilled too much beer up there and I was slipping and sliding. And uh, for tomorrow's show at uh, CBGB's, what are you going to be doing about the guitar situation? You trashed one of your guitars tonight, so are you down to one or do you have some backups in reserve for the rest of the shows? I didn't even think about that. <laughs> oh, you might, you're going to wake up tomorrow and go, shit, now I only have one guitar. Chris from Gang Green, thanks for being with us on Hype TV and continued success and have a good tour. Thanks, man. You're welcome.